Preparations are in progress to crash test Volvo Truck's new hybrid truck, the Volvo FE Hybrid. Volvo Trucks imposes the same crash safety requirements, regardless of the product. However, these requirements may vary depending on the driveline and fuel. Crash tests are particularly important for the new Volvo FE Hybrid, which is powered in parallel by an electric motor and a diesel engine. Well, it's extremely important now that we are working with alternative drive lines, and uh, there are some things that are very different on them, such as uh, the battery pack that is sitting on the side of the vehicle. So we need to make sure that this is very safe. A number of different scenarios with the Volvo FE Hybrid have been simulated and evaluated. In this case, the scenario involves a car that hits the battery unit in the truck at a speed of 46 kilometers an hour. This is a fairly normal situation in, in the traffic environment in, in a city where you have a lot of crossings and, and you might get a, somebody runs a red light or something like that and then crashes into the side of the truck. The test has one main purpose, to see how the battery unit in the hybrid truck withstands a hard impact. A fire is totally unacceptable. No dangerous fluids must be allowed to leak onto the road surface and the advanced safety system in the battery unit must automatically turn off the electrical system in a collision. It was a perfect performed test. Everything was running exactly as we, we would like to have it with the trolley and the speed and the impact area. And what we can see is that the complete battery box is sta very stable. Uh, we didn't see any increase of uh, heating, no burning, no gas leakage, uh, and the electrical system was still protected intact and closed down during uh, in the impact. You need to do a real-life test to make sure that uh, this is what is going to happen. And, and I think we got a very good confirmation here because uh, we were a little uncertain prior to this. And to make sure that uh, this is what we were looking for, we did the test and it worked out very well. So uh, I think we, we have a, a better feeling now, you know, that we can release this product and say it is safe, just as a Volvo always should be.